Guys, it's time for part three of our San Diego Comic-Con haul. Are you ready? What's up guys, I am Nick and today we are gonna try, well we can't finish it because there's actually, I think, two more, two or three more items that should be coming in. Um, I don't wanna give any spoilers, but they haven't arrived yet, so we are patiently waiting. Hopefully by next week, we will be all wrapped up with San Diego Comic-Con and moving on to the next best thing. But without further ado, let's get started. All right guys, item number one is from, this is Hot Topic. So let's see what we've got. All right, starting off, this was on the list. We have the Coon from South Park. Now, again, I, I did have this on the list. I'm a huge fan of South Park. I was happy to get him. His box, uh, I've heard some stories about Hot Topic, and honestly, his box is not in that bad a shape, but it looks like they may have slit the top of the box when they were opening it. I'm assuming when they got their shipment, there's a couple of dents on the box, but again, it's not that bad. I really just collect these for the pops, not more for the resale value, unless it's something that's really rare then I kind of want to have a, a nice box just in case because you never know. But yeah, looking at the pop, uh, it looks good. Everything looks good. There's some minor paint details that I'm not too satisfied with. I may honestly take this back and exchange it. I got to double check to see if I bought this with PayPal or my credit card because I've heard stories that if you buy it with PayPal, they won't really let you exchange it in store. But We'll see. So that was number one, and this was, again, on the list. This is the Coon from South Park. All right, guys, number two from Hot Topic, we have, again, this was on the list, and it's from The Walking Dead, T-Dog. Now, I am very satisfied with this one, as the box did come in pretty good shape. Uh, again, huge Walking Dead fan, so I'm definitely glad to have this. The paint job looks great. Um, no, no uh, errors as I can tell or that I can tell, you know, th th these things don't necessarily always come perfect, but you know, from the look of it, it looks pretty decent. So uh, yeah, I'm glad to have it. I'm glad the box came in pretty good shape. Not much else to say. I think I've pretty much given the rundown on, on T-Dog and uh, yeah, glad to have it. So that's number two. We've got T-Dog from The Walking Dead. All right, guys, the third and final piece from Hot Topic. Now, I wonder if you guys can guess what this is. Probably not, because this wasn't on the list. But when I seen it and I saw that it was available, I figured, let me try and grab it. And I was lucky enough to grab it. This is the Looney Tunes 2-pack, the Dorbs of Bugs Bunny and Yosemite Sam. Now, I'm not a huge Dorbs collector. I'm actually not a Dorbs collector at all. But um, it's limited to 2,700 pieces. And who knows, I got it because maybe I might either use this as a trade because, spoiler alert, I did not get a chance to grab the Ren and Stimpy 2-pack, which I want. So if anybody has it and wants to trade, let me know. My information is in the description below. But looking at the 2-pack, it looks like it is in great shape. I'm not going to take it out again because I am hopefully going to use this as trade bait. So if anybody has the Ren and Stimpy 2-pack, please contact me. The box is in perfect condition and the dorbs look like they, the paint job looks great. Again, this is limited to 2,700 pieces and I am up for a trade. So that completes the Hot Topic haul. Now let's move on to the remaining few. All right guys, so the last two boxes that we got here are both from the same place we have from Box Lunch. Um, and the smaller box, let's open that up real quick. The packaging wasn't that bad, it was fully bubble wrapped. I'm sure you probably could see through it. And we have, wow. We have the Mr. Robot Elliot mask. Now he was on the list, but one of the problems here is the box looks ridiculous. I don't know if I'm gonna have a close up here so you guys can check it out, but the front looks great, but then when I turn it around, the it's just smashed. I don't know what happened. I'm assuming, I mean, this is clearly, if you can see the box here, there's no damage on this box, but there's a lot of damage inside. So I'm assuming this was a packing error from their part. Maybe they wrapped it too tightly with the bubble wrap and something went wrong there, but yeah. Um, I do like the pop. I'm gonna try and contact them to see if I can get an exchange. So Box Lunch, you'll be hearing from my lawyer. All right guys, moving on to the last box, which again, this is from Box Lunch. You saw the difficulty that we had with that last one where the Elliot was crushed. So let's hope that everything in here, the box looks like it's in great shape. Hopefully you can see that, but let's hope that when they were packing it, they took their time and everything looks good. Let's check it out. 
All right, guys. So opening the box. So we the first item, again, wrapped up. Let's see how it looks. And this is another Elliot mask. Now, the reason why I have two Elliot masks are because if you remember the last video, I got the Negatron, which I am going to trade my brother, Andrew, who lives in PA. And he wanted this as he's a huge fan of the show, Mr. Robot. Uh, this box doesn't look too bad, but I mean, you know, if you're spending your money and you're buying something like this, which is considered an exclusive, you definitely want to get your money's worth and you want it to be in as perfect condition as possible. So two for two on the damaged boxes. I am going to definitely try and see if I can exchange these in store. I don't have one necessarily around here, but I'll try to see if I can find one up in Jersey or, or somewhere, see if he has a, a store up there. Um, but yeah, this is Elliot Mast and it looks like both of them, both of the boxes came in damaged. All right guys, so the final item from this box lunch haul is the 2017 exclusive Dorbs ride Aladdin with magic carpet and a boon. Again, I'm not a Dorbs collector, but I picked this up just in case if anybody wanted this and couldn't get their hands on it, I am up for a trade as again, I did not or I wasn't able to uh, pick up that Ren and Stimpy two pack. So yeah, this will be available for trade as well as the Looney Tunes Dorbs pack, which was very, which was limited to 2,700 pieces. So. Yeah, I mean, it, you know, for Dorps collectors, the box is in great condition and the pop looks like the paint job is in great condition as well. So again, if anybody wants to trade and they're feeling generous and want to help a brother out, please contact me. Again, my contact information is in the description below. All right, guys, so that concludes haul number three. These are all the items. Again, this was from Hot Topic and Box Lunch. And I think I still have like three items coming in. I don't want to give any spoilers. Um, but yeah, I have three more items that should be coming in soon. If not by this week, definitely by Wednesday, they should be in. We can have that video ready for you and we can move on to more greatness. But without further ado, if you enjoyed this video like my boy Deadpool, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. Be sure to check back with us next week when we will possibly have the fourth and final haul from San Diego Comic-Con 2017. I'm Nick. This is The Collector Zone, and I will see you next week.